Okay, uh, in this next video, this is going to be a real short one. I sort of rushed through the last one, and I did it on purpose. That was video number six. This is video number seven. But let's get back to where we are here. We sliced all these up, and this is the normal phase. And if I click here, this is the over phase, all grouped up. You know there's stuff inside here. Uh, and what each one of these, and let's go back, these are slices. What you did was you made an image in Photoshop, 900 by 50, and then you made a color, and then you put text in, and then you sliced it. Well, this is the normal uh, phase of it, and it sliced one, two, three, four, and five. Then we sliced the over phase, which is also one, two, three, four, and five. Then we saved them for web and devices after selecting them. And if you need to review, you can go back to video number six. And then I made a folder. Now, I'm going to close up Photoshop just for a second here. I made a photo folder on my desktop, and the folder was called Images. You always, I think you know how to make a folder by now, but if not, you have to go to the Finder, which is here. Make sure Finder is up here, and you click New Folder. I can click a new folder and it comes out here and then I can put in whatever I want and I can put them all into a folder if I want. But what I did was, let me get rid of it. What I did was I put them all into a folder. So here's the normal, which is the green with the white text. Uh, slice number one, slice number two, slice number three, slice number four, slice number five. And this is the over, one, two, three, four, and five. And this is what it would look like in HTML, which is in a browser, whether it's Safari or Chrome, uh, one of those or another one. So I double click on this and just to give you an idea, there's nothing here, but you can see there's slices here. And those slices will come up once we get working on video number eight. So if you have all these, so Photoshop did a lot of it for you, but you did the most of the work by slicing and naming and all those things. So now we're going to continue with uh, video number eight, and uh, we should be good to go. Thanks for watching.